Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's answer the question, why does the United States have two geographic centers? You may have heard these descriptions before, East Coast versus West Coast. She's from the South. My father was raised in the North. Have you ever thought where does the North begin in the U.S.? And where does East actually begin also in the U.S.? Let's have a quick review of cardinal directions. You may remember this, never eat soggy waffles. If you go in a clockwise manner, you get north, east, south, and west. But on a map of the US, where is the center? In 1918, the National Geological Society declared a location near Lebanon, Kansas as the center of the United States. Here's the exact GPS coordinates. They even built a nice monument to mark the spot at Smith Center. Everything was good and dandy until 1959 when Alaska and Hawaii became part of the United States and this moved the geographic center of the overall United States approximately 550 miles or 885 kilometers northwest by north to a location in an uninhabited patch of private pasture land approximately 12 miles east of where South Dakota, Wyoming, and Montana borders meet. Here's the exact GPS coordinates. To help the public out, there is a nearby marker located in the park in Belle Fouche. So in summary, if you want the center of the 48 states that touch one another, travel to Smith Center near Lebanon, Kansas. If you want the center of all 50 states, including Alaska and Hawaii, travel to Belle Fouche. Thanks for watching and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.